Hi friends, today we are discussing the one more concept, two port, two port network modules in transmission line. We are discussing here. Port is nothing but port is nothing but a pair of terminals. Means port is nothing but a pair of terminals. A pair of terminals means phase router port is nothing but a pair of terminals phase and motor this is called two port two port is nothing but double port means one port is nothing but phase and motor two port is nothing but two is double port means uh, sending side and the receiving side Sending and receiving end. Receiving end. Sending end and receiving end. Port, finally port is nothing but this is the port. Pay, this is called for example phase motor. Pair is, uh, port is nothing but a pair of terminals. This is the one port. 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 Two ports. That is called two port. In this, this is called sending and current. This voltage is called sending and voltage. This current is called this current is called receiving and current. This voltage is called receiving and voltage. This is called port. Means some port. Some parameters. A B C D parameters like that. This is called uh, port and two port for the example. This is the port. Means in this uh, two port network modules means this is called two port network modules. Means Vs is equal to Vs and Is. This is called A plus B C D. V R I R. We are here. This is called equation one. This is called equation two. From this two port network, from this two port network, Vs and Is means this is called Vs and this is called Is. These are the ABCD. These are the ABCD uh, transmission line parameters or ABCD parameters. This is called Vr and Is. This is called Vr. This is called Is. Receiving and current and receiving and voltage. In this Two port networks. These are the unknown values. These are the known values. Means this sending unknown side. These are the unknown, uh, this unknown sending and values calculated. This is sending and unknown values is calculated. Calculated using this known things. With the help of some transmission line parameters or A, B, C, D parameters, we can calculate. Finally, A is only the we can calculate the this uh, sending end terminals V S and I S. V S and I S we are calculated with the help of known things and network transmission parameters or A, B, C, D parameters. A, B, C, D parameters. V S, I S. Is equal to A B C D is equal to V R and I R. From this e, from these two equations, you will get V S and I S. These are the sending side. This is the these are the unknown sending side. This is the port. These are the receiving end receiving end parameters. These are the receiving parameters. These are called known parameters. These are the unknown parameters. These are the known parameters. These are the unknown parameters. We can calculate. Uh, equation one is the a equal to d. A equal to d is nothing but symmetry. A equal to d in this network represented as a symmetric network. 
in this network will represent it as a symmetric network a is equal to d second one second equation is the ad minus bc is equal to 1 ad minus bc is equal to 1 in this network is called reciprocal reciprocal network in this ad minus bc is equal to 1 is called as a reciprocal network reciprocal network for example for the uh, reciprocal for example for the ad minus bc is equal to 1 the reciprocal the reciprocal network the ratio of voltage to current the ratio of voltage to current is the same after you are interchanging also the values is coming same that is called a reciprocal this is called as excitation this is called excitation this is called a response excitation and the response after it will be interchange interchange also is same that is called as reciprocal network for example conductor for example this is the conductor this is the conductor this is the conductor this is the sending end this is the load this is the load supply you are given this side conductor is carrying you are using the load you are using the load same conductor same conductor same conductor source you are given this side current carrying in this conductor load you are using this side means conductor means finally uh, aim is only the the current is sending this side is passing the current is sending this side is passing means the conductor is the bilateral element the conductor is the bilateral elements means you can pass supply is given load is taken here also same supply is given load is taken means you give both sides all electrical networks are all electrical equipment is the uh, reciprocal uh, uh, reciprocal network all electrical elements is the reciprocal in transmission in transmission lines also reciprocal but uh, may may not symmetry all transmission all transmission lines is a reciprocal may or may not be symmetrical may or may not be symmetrical network may or may not be symmetrical network next is the units units of the a b c d parameters units of a b c d parameters what are the units what are the units of a b c d parameters this is the network a b c d this is the sending end this is the receiving end this is the sending end voltage this current is called sending end current these are the port a b c d this is called as load voltage this current is called as load current this current is called as load current in this equation you will get vs is equal to vs and is is equal to a b c d v r i r v r i r previously already this equation is kept from this from this two equations from this two equations case one this current is zero this current is zero means this is the open circuit this is the open circuit open circuit open circuit at receiving end open circuit at the receiving end open circuit at receiving end means vr is equal to vr not 
we r is equal to vr not i r is the zero how we these values we can substitute here how we will get vs is equal to what you i r is zero where is the r this is the zero v r is equal to v r not v r is equal to v r not v r is equal to this is called as v r is equal to v r not this v r uh, this uh, i r is zero here also i r is zero v s is equal to a v r plus v r not i r is zero this is zero this is called equation three after that in this a is equal to v s by v r not second one same this is zero i s is equal to c into v r not in this c is equal to i s by v r not i s by v r not this is the one equation this is the one equation no units here units is the here units is the open circuit open circuit admittance a d m i admittance open circuit admittance receiving open circuit admittance open circuit admittance units is the ohms units is the ohms cam h y s units is the ohms this is the one equation this is the one equation second one is second one second one is the second one is the short circuited means vr is equal to 0 vr is equal to 0 vr is equal to 0 means short circuited short circuited at receiving end short circuited at receiving end short circuited at receiving end we can substitute vr not vr is zero vr is zero means vs is equal to v into ir v is equal to vs by ir this is the one equation second vr not is zero means is is equal to d into ir d is equal to is by ir this is the one equation this is the one equation this units is called this units is called this units is called impedance means short circuit impedance short circuit impedance short circuit impedance you uh, units is the ohms units is the ohms here unitless here is the unitless no units here is the unitless here is the no units here is the unitless here is the open circuit admittance units is the ohms here short circuit impedance units is the ohms this is called ohms this is called ohms these are called units of the abcd parameters these are these are all called as units of the abcd parameter next if you go for the polar representation polar representation polar polar representation polar representation polar representation of trans polar representation of abcd parameters of transmission line parameters a is equal to modulo of a at an angle alpha b is equal to modulo of b at an angle of beta c is equal to modulo of c at an angle of gamma d is equal to modulo of d at an angle of alpha these are all the four polar networks polar representation in this polar representation in this polar representation short transmission line how is it is happen short transmission line in this short transmission line the capacitance 
give azimuth to zero the capacitance the capacitance approximately zero the capacitance is approximately zero so that modulo modulo of a is equal to 1 modulo of a is equal to 1 alpha is 0 alpha is 0 next modulo of b modulo of b is equal to modulo of b is equal to r square plus x square modulo of b beta is equal to tan inverse of x by r tan inverse of x by r the angle it will be approximately 60 degrees it will come in next if you go for the modulo of c omega c omega c gamma is equal to tan inverse of g by g tan inverse of this is also capacitance is zero this angle also zero this angle also zero finally a is equal to d same d value a value both are same second one medium transmission line medium transmission line how is it happen these are all the polar representation model a is the 0.95 alpha is the 2 degrees alpha is the 2 degrees alpha is the 2 degrees model b is equal to r square plus x square angle uh, beta is equal to tan inverse of x by r this angle approximately approximately 70 degrees 70 degrees c omega c omega c omega c as the gamma to 90 degrees same a is equal to d a is equal to d these are the medium transmission lines next if you go for the long transmission line in this long transmission line modulo of a is equal to 0.9 alpha is 5 degrees modulo of b is equal to r square plus x square beta is equal to tan inverse of x by r it will come 80 degrees modulo of c is equal to omega c here gamma 85 degrees gamma is 90 degrees here also a equal to t these are the polar representation these are the polar representation of the uh, short transmission line medium transmission line long transmission line these are the polar representation in two port network modules of transmission lines